In this video, we will be creating this uh, function right here in MATLAB. And so if you're in thermodynamics, you probably know what ICPH function is, but I'm just gonna show you guys how to create this function in MATLAB. So in order to create this function in MATLAB, first you need to write function, space, uh, square bracket, we can call it I, uh, space ICPH, that's the function name, and with ICPH, there are a couple of unknowns, T original, T final, and our heat capacities, A, B, C, and D. And here we have a quick description. So now we say that I is equal to the equation that we had. So I'm simply copying down the equation that we saw earlier. And then we put an end. Now it's a working function. Now let's try some numbers. So in order for this to work, we have our name and the name is ICPH, ICPH. Then we do a parentheses. And this parentheses, once you put one parentheses, it kind of gives you a hint. It tells you that first you need to write your T original, then you need to write your T, then A, B, C, and D. And so here I will try my own numbers. So I have ICPH, the T original, I had this number, T final, I had this number, our A value, our B value, our C value, and finally our D value. If I hit enter, it gives me the answer. Now, let's just prove that this is a function. If I change these numbers here, I should get a new number if this is a working function. We hit enter, and we get this value. And so, one another thing we could do is, if you wanna make sure that you wrote this one correctly, try my numbers, and your answer should be the same of this value right here. And that's all I need to do to create this function in MATLAB.